Hello and welcome back to another Rogue Nano Plays. This time it's kind of like a tutorial, just how to maximize your points at the very beginning of the game. Now for this one I've chosen Mob of the Dead, uh, just because it's the most recent and a lot of people pretty much are used to this. Uh, pretty much what you want to do is let every zombie pretty much break in. Uh, shoot him six times around the guts. That way you can actually maximize your points and won't accidentally kill him. You shoot him in the head, um, it just drops their life by about 20 or 30%. Uh, somewhere along the line of that, so you can do more damage to him, which we don't exactly want to do. I'm going to wait for him to break in. Now you don't want to get the double points straight away. As we always see a lot of people do, the first thing they do is run in there, activate it and grab it. Pretty much goes to waste on the first round. You want to grab it around the second, third round? No, probably, th no, third or fourth round. So here we go. So you go six shots and then stab them. Now whenever they get... Uh, one behind another it is kind of difficult um, your bullets do go through so you get twice the amount depending on how many are behind there so there you go four shots and it dies so if there's every zombie behind one um, you know you can shoot him another three times and then stab him three four five six stab one two whoops three four five six stab one, two, three, four. Just to be in a safe side, if you're not too sure on loose count like I just did, just um, stab them. You still get, I think it's 120 points per kill. Um, reason why you leave the windows open is that once the zombies come in, they do tend to drop power-ups. Um, sometimes max ammo, double points, uh, even a nuke sometimes. Uh, the nuke is good. Um, the beginning of the rounds, it is semi-useful. Um, some people kind of complain that um, you just wipe out all the zombies, which you do pretty much, but you still end up with 400 points in the end. It's really good, especially if you have double points. Now, pretty much I've completely run out of ammo. Um, normally, you get the M14 carbine off the wall. Um, it is pretty effective in the lower rounds. Um, as the round goes on, um, you pretty much shoot, stab, shoot, stab. Um, yeah, it went through. Pretty much goes like that. So for round three, you shoot them twice and then um, stab. Pretty much each additional round. Yeah, there you go. So I'm almost at round three and my points are 2,600 already. The Olympia isn't really a good gun to start off with. It is pretty strong, but after about the fifth or sixth round, it's pretty much useless. Unless you go right up close to him and shoot him in the head, that's really the only way you can kill him. Um, it's not really a practical gun to use, especially when there's a lot of them around each other. So look, one, two, stab, one, two, stab, one, two, stab, one, two, stab, stab. Quite simple, quick and easy, very useful in early rounds. Uh, kind of a bit of a panic there. <laughs> so you want to maximize your points, you do it this way. Um, if you have your pistol, pretty much empty a uh, whole clip in them on the second round. Uh, I've never really counted how many bullets, just stay on the safe side pretty much. So there you go, I'm round four and I already have 4,000 uh, points. So now I'm going to go grab the double points and see how much of a difference it would be compared to if you were to use it in the very beginning round. Actually, I'll grab it as a person. Go. Okay. Grab it. One, two, three. Oh, whoops. A bit of a headshot. One, two, three. Stab. Oh, insta-kill. Pretty much just stab him on the insta-kill. 
um, you get more points than what you would do shooting it. Whenever I see someone shooting when they have insta kill, it just makes me cry and die on the inside a little bit. Main reason being is just maximize your points, especially with double points and insta kill. You cannot go wrong. Best thing. Okie dokie. Last zombie happens to be a runner. They got max ammo. Let's see how many bullets he takes. One clip in him. Yeah, oh, whoops. Shot him in the head. Kind of ruined it. But there you go. I'm at round five and I already have 8,850 points. Pretty much it can keep on repeating the process, but you don't exactly want to stay in the beginning area for too long. Mainly because the warden comes in here and your guns are really weak. I hope this helps in any possible way. Like, favorite, subscribe. I'm Rogue Nana and I'm out.